Hey guys and welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be here on the Hunter Call of the Wild. We're out here on Leighton Lakes and we're going to be doing the Blacktail Guide. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So the Blacktail, they drink from 1600 to 2000 hours as you can see right there. They are class 4 animals so that's going to give you quite a few different options on the guns you could use. Today we have with us the 303, the M1, the Malmer 7mm, and the Zarza 308. So the same four guns that we always carry around when we're covering like classes 4 to 8. These guns are fantastic um, and any gun that covers class 4 is going to be a good one to use on the bike tail. It just really comes down to preference. Max level is 5 medium. Max weight is 95 kg. Silver is 76.9. Gold is 134.4. And diamond is 177.5. Common fur types are dark gray, gray, and gray brown. Rare fur types are albino, melanistic, and piebald. And then you can use the deer bleak collar, the deer grunt collar, or the blacktail scent to the literal men. But that pretty much does it here for the information, so let's not waste any time. Let's go take down some blacktail. So we're going to be starting things off at this lake right here. Um, it's actually a pretty good one for the blacktail. It has quite a few zones for me. I think all of these are blacktail zones, so there is four over here. This outpost is the Chila outpost, and we actually have some that are fleeing right now. I kind of came in here a little bit too quickly, and they were already starting to flee as I went down and crouched. But we have a big one right there. He's actually diamond potential. We said diamond is 177. He's a level 4, 151 to 179, so he probably won't be a diamond, obviously. But he has a little shot there, so we'll probably end up taking that one down. Do we have any others? Yes, we do, and they are just now coming in. So there's a level 3, 99 to 128. That's level 2, 81 to 110. So we have some options here. I didn't really check out the ones that were fleeing because I don't know exactly what we had. But there's a level 3, 132 to 161. That's a decent level 3. Um, what else? Looks like a bunch of level 2s. That one's a level 2, and that one also looks to be like a level 2. 61 to 90 for his estimates. So this one seems to be the best one. Let's go ahead and let's get him down really quickly. I think there might be a female there behind the tree. Looks like a female. Hopefully it's not a male. I'm a big male or anything like that. Let's go ahead and let's get this one. We actually have some over here as well, and it's going to be right there beside us. Level 3, 117 to 146. So he's going to end up fleeing, and there's a that's a black bear right there. So let's go ahead and let's get this black tail down. So we'll go for something like that, and it's going to be fantastic. And there is quite a few over there, actually. That's um, and it looks like a level 3, maybe a small level 4. Um, I don't know if we'll be able to spot him there. It's actually level 4. He's actually a big one. 165 to 193. Did not even see that guy over there. Okay. That's kind of interesting. Let's see if maybe we can potentially get him. They were all kind of tucked into the um, trees there, so I didn't even realize that they were all over there like that. So we might be able to get him again. Maybe he'll come back in. I think I'm just going to sit around and wait for a little bit. So while we're um, kind of just talking and stuff, the Blacktail, they are pretty much all on the right side of the map. You're not going to really find any here on the left side. If you cut the map in half, like right here, go along the river, and then kind of cut it right there, and then come all the way down through here, they're going to be on this entire right side. All along the coast here, there's a ton of zones for them. So yeah, I'm just going to kind of sit around and see if maybe we can get that big one, because he did have some really good estimates there. I will let you know if he comes back in. I doubt that level 4 is actually going to come back in here, but we do have this herd that I spooked off when I was running down. They did decide to come back over here, so there's that level 3. He had a pretty decent um, estimate. I think he went up to like 161 or something like that. Really couldn't spot him there, but we got him down probably with like a neck shot or heart shot just by the way he dropped there. So we're going to go ahead and grab him really quickly, and then we will go get the other level 4 that we took down. So yeah, kind of unfortunate. I did not realize that that big level 4 was in there, or I would have actually went for him. Just did not know there was that many in that herd. They kind of just all came out of nowhere. But here is this one. We do have the Vital Blood. Like I said, he is a level 3. A pretty decent one at that. And he's going to be a silver at 133.77. We got him there in the lower neck. So like I thought, he was either going to be the neck or the heart. And it was a neck shot. So it's always really it's always really satisfying when they drop like that from a neck shot. So let's go ahead and accept him. And let's go grab this level 4 over here. And then here's our level 4, let's go ahead and grab him here. He's going to be a gold at 176.79, holy crap, he's actually really, really big. Um, Diamond, like we said, is 177, he was at the top end of his estimates pretty much. He went up to 179, that is absolutely crazy, he is a monster level 4. Um, the other one that went up to like 190 something, I doubt he would be a diamond level 4, um, I, I mean he could be, but I doubt he is, but this one is just, he's bigger than I thought he was going to be for sure. But got him there in the left lung and the right lung, that is pretty impressive, I'm going to go ahead and get a few screenshots here. This will probably be the biggest one we take down today. We are now here at this lake, it's just directly north from the lake we just came from. This outpost is the northern outpost and we're still here on the right side of the map. We have a couple males up ahead, there actually is three zones over here, but there's not a lot of males, it's literally just these two, level 3, 129 to 157, and this one a level 2, 74 to 102. 
And then that is pretty much it for the males. Saw some other zones over here that only had females in it. Now your map is completely different, so this lake might be loaded down with males for you. It really just is random for everyone. But we're going to go ahead and take down this level 3. He's decent, I guess you could say. Let's go ahead and get the M1 out. And let's go ahead and take him down here. We'll go for that right there. And it's going to be fantastic. He is going to be dropped right there on the spot. And then here's our level 3 and picking him up. He's going to be a silver at 129.69. Got him there in the left lung and the right lung. And also got the stomach as well. So a little bit far back on that shot. But double lung, you really can't ask for too much better than that. We are now here at the very top right hand corner of the map at this little lake right here. It's once again another good one in terms of the zones. It has three zones on it. I'm not too sure exactly what is in this one to the left and this one on the right as well because I have not seen anything over here yet. But we do have a really good one with a bunch of males straight in front of us here. Especially that level 4, 147 to 176. He is only one point below diamond there. So we're definitely going to take him down. There's level 2, 87 to 116. I think there's two level 2s over here, and there's the other one, 93 to 122. And I think there's a level 3, yeah, right behind the level 4, 109 to 138. So let's go ahead and let's get the level 4 down. I am going to switch to the night vision binoculars here, just because it is starting to get nighttime. And I think I already switched over here. Yeah, I already switched over on the Malmer 7mm. So we're going to go ahead and take him down. So I do recommend that you do get the night vision binoculars and the night vision scope. Both of those come with the high tech pack. It'll just be good for the young um, blacktail, especially since they do drink partially in the nighttime here. So let's go ahead. Let's get him down. And that is going to be fantastic. He's going to be dropped on the spot. They're all going to flee. And I don't see any others fleeing over here. Like I said, I'm not too sure exactly what is in these zones to my left and the right. But let's go get that level four. And then here is this level 4, and he's going to be a gold at 148.31. So not super big, not towards the top end of his estimates or anything like that. Just kind of right there in the middle. Got him in the left lung and the right lung. Perfect shot on him at 219 meters. So yeah, I think we're going to go ahead and head down there now and actually take down the big one. Probably going to reset the time a little bit. What time is it right now? It's 1930, so yeah, he's still probably going to be nervous. And chances are he might not even be over there. So I think I'm just going to reset the time, reset the game and everything, and then we're going to head down there and take him down and see if he's a diamond level 4. Highly doubt it, but I'm just kind of curious to see what his score is going to be. And finally, here he is, 165 to 193 for his estimates. Is he going to be a diamond level 4? I highly doubt it. That rack is kind of all over the place there. I mean, it's kind of wonky just a little bit. And he doesn't really look like as big as the um, level 4 we took down over here previously. But who knows? I don't know too much um, about the racks and stuff. We're going to go ahead and take him down and we will just see here. Let's go ahead and get these stars at 308 and let's take that shot. So it's going to be a single lung and he's going to be dropping very, very quickly. And he is going to be down. So we're not going to waste any time. We're going to run over here and we're going to pick him up. So here he is, guys. Let's go ahead and pick him up. He's going to be a gold at 168.27, and we got him there in the left lung, so nice single lung shot, but he is nowhere close to being a diamond. I didn't think he was going to be one just by looking at his rack. He's pretty wonky. He doesn't look as big as the one we took down over here previously, but he still is a decent one, 168.27. And something I've kind of noticed with a lot of different species, if they have a max level of level 5, they can sometimes make diamond at level 4. But I've noticed that if it has a really big estimate like this one, chances are it's not going to be um, as close to diamond as you might think. Um, the one that we took down here previously went up to 179, and he was closer to diamond. He was a 176 for his trophy rating. So I find that the ones that have a smaller estimate tend to be closer to diamond than the ones with the bigger estimate. So that's just something to kind of keep in mind. I don't know if that's just me that has noticed that. But it's just kind of interesting if you think about it. But we're going to go ahead and accept him here. And that's pretty much going to do it for this part of the guide. So let's go ahead and jump into the map guide. Here's the Leighton Lakes Blacktail map guide, so let's go ahead and take a look at it. So like I said in the beginning of the video, they pretty much drink all along the right side of the map. The lakes are really good, especially the small ones for whatever reason. The small lakes tend to be the best for me. The um, coast over there is also pretty good. I just don't hunt it that often. There's a ton of zones. I just don't hunt it because it's kind of hard to hunt. But yeah, that's pretty much going to do it here for this guide. I really do hope it was helpful. And if it was, remember to like, subscribe, comment, do all that stuff. It really does help out the channel. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.